<laughs> Wait, what did they do? Not that. Ooh. Not that. Do a loon. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> Welcome to Upgrade My Stay, the show where me, Kelsey, and me, Becky, check into vacation rentals with the goal of upgrading the stay experience with some DIY, design, and decor, all before checkout. I think, oh, okay, I think we're good to go. Okay, so today, our host, Holly and Abby. Holly and Abby, mother-daughter with a couple cabins on Lake Temiskaming. Lake Temiskaming. <laughs> so the fun part is that Abby actually was a viewer of our channel mm -hmm. and reached out and said that she wanted to do something to one of the cottages, spruce it up a little bit. There is one in specific that's a little more outdated than the rest. Yeah. And I think we can do some really awesome stuff to it. And the whole reason we wanted to start this series is because we wanted to do these fun kind of themed spaces that yeah. we couldn't do in a regular regular old person's living room. So I'm excited to really lean into this theme of 50s, beach, vintage, retro, almost like a fun like retro diner experience since we're doing the most in like the kitchen, the dining area, and the living room. Yeah, and then just showing a little bit of um, small tweaks in the bedroom. I think that's also going to be really useful for people just in general to see that you don't need to do so much in a room to really make a big difference. I'm hoping we can make a big difference. And we actually previously went up there and scouted, took measurements. We already kind of thought we wanted to go the 50s route once we heard that these cabins were from the 50s. And then we saw this um, creamer, <laughs> a coffee creamer on the fridge. And we were like, this, I think this is the color scheme we need to go for. And before we arrive, I do want to acknowledge that we are grateful to spend time on land that has been inhabited by the Algonquin Cree and the Anishinaabewaki people. I think we're getting close. I feel like too. Where is it? I don't remember driving this far last time. For real, for real. Did we pass it? Did we pass it? What's oh. the house number? There's a, ch there's a chance we could have. <laughs> Wait, what? I'm so confused. Is this it? This has got to be it. Okay, hold on. One more bed. Ah, I found it. There we are. Here we go. Here. Sunnydale Cottages. Cottage 3 is the best cottage on the property because yeah. it's totally lakefront. Uh, the whole window at the front of it is all you see is lake and I find it to be very peaceful. I'll be happy to see the smile on people's faces when the people that rent that cottage all the time specifically ask for it and then they see the change. I'll be very happy to see yeah. that, to see other people's reaction. again just how I remembered it basically <laughs> um, okay so I think game plan is really to just clear things mm -hmm. out first but um, there's some stuff we have to do in the kitchens I guess we can take off all the cabinets right now too yep the cabinet doors basically clearing the entire living room couch is staying yeah should we start by just I think clearing it's out to <laughs> okay sounds good yeah I'm just I'm just gonna grab stuff okay It is cute. They have a lot of like really good detail pieces. That's the best part about doing a vintage design is I feel like throw some vintage stuff. You can get away with a lot of things. Like this guy? Oh no. 
I kind of love him. What is it? I think he can come back in. I think he really should. It, it's on the color scheme. Why do I want to pet it? <laughs> He's so soft. There's lots of them, though. How many do we want? <gasps> All of them. Do we want this one? They're a little fam. I love how they're, like, not the same, but they are. Ooh, wait, what do they do? Not that. Ooh. Not that. Do a loon. <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> no, what is it though? Yeah. I think this is definitely the move to get rid of these doors because then we can showcase this stuff, right? Yeah. In the other cupboard, there was like some fun old like Pyrex stuff. Oh. Very of the time. Isn't that so funny? Mm -hmm. I we're like, yes, Pyrex. I know, but yes. then, when like your mom's using it when you grow up, you're like, it's oh, so outdated. <laughs> Sorry, mom. Uncork and unwind. I should have been like, what wine pun do you think it is, Becky? <laughs> is it wine all day or? It's wine o'clock. It's wine o'clock. <laughs> what else we got? Um, don't talk to me till I've had my wine. <laughs> I don't know. Coffee will make your wine? Yeah. I'll pass me a box when you're done. You'll only get this if you're from a certain place in the world. <laughs> what is this used for? Let us know in the comments down below. What beverage what do we need this for? Beverage. <laughs> Probably not the one you're thinking. Oh god. Yeah! yeah. Okay. Oh wow, that's gonna look so much better already. Well, it'll literally just match that side. Bless. Um, I guess these can come off too, and we're gonna be replacing these doors. They need some love. So um, all of this has to come off. Okay, yes, let's work on that, and then I can just start patching everything so we can really get to painting. Does that mm -hmm. work? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Sweet. So we're repainting basically all the walls in this main space and just going over it all with the white because the beige was making it feel really dingy and just darker in here than it needed to be. And white paint is such an easy hack to just make a space feel fresh, new, bright, and bigger than it was before. Something we are making sure to do though is keep the barn board. I would hate to paint over it, it's such a beautiful feature. And I think the fact that it is an aged gray barn board wood kind of leans driftwood, which really works with the beach theme we have going on. Wanna get in that lake. It is hot out. My paint's gonna dry so fast. Oh, man. that's true. So I know it's like probably not cool for most people to paint over a nice wood table like this, but I literally found it in the garbage and I just think the space needs a pop of color. Yeah. Do I have permission? I will give you permission on behalf of the entire internet to paint that. It's gonna look so good. Okay. It's yours or mine? Oh, oh, baby. Oh, baby. I bet everybody's like, orange again. <laughs> or no, orange you didn't. Well, it's funny because I learned from last time and I was like, okay, let's go darker because it's gonna look more extreme in real life. So we aim darker and that still looks really bright. Oh, that's pretty. Yes, love this. My 50s blue. Okay. Okay. Let's get to it. This little guy was in the bedroom. It's just one of those things that I wanted to change up to amp up that bedroom. Yeah, that's got a really interesting shape, but I feel like you don't you don't appreciate it because the wood is kind of boring. Yeah, yeah. Oh my God, it's so hot. <laughs> oh yeah, that's fun. That's fun. I know there's gonna be a lot of people that were like, how dare you paint it, how dare, but it's so nice. You good? I don't have sunscreen it's on. It's steamy. I'm bad. Do you want a sunscreen moment on camera? I mean, I could if I have some. <gasps> This is pretty much done for now. How's that looking? I still have a, a little, a couple more coats. It is looking good though. Um, 
I guess I'll leave you to finish that. I can start working on other things like those trees need to get planted. Should I do that? Yeah, you have fun with that. Okay, <laughs> thank you. So, last time we were here, Holly mentioned that she'd love us to figure out some sort of privacy for people sitting on the front porch here so the neighbors can't see you all the time. So we thought it'd be really nice to plant like a natural row of trees to act as a privacy fence. It'll probably take a few seasons for them to grow into full privacy mode, but I think they'll look really cute in the meantime anyways. Like, look how cute these are. Yeah, those are so much better. I agree. Uh, they just need to be painted. So we have that. That's not the color, but that's the primer. Yeah, they almost look too modern. So it'd be nice to match them to like the old cabinets. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Cool. Um, I guess I'll take these off then. <laughs> yeah. And then speaking of, we do have patching to do on that. I can grab that paint and just do that. Yeah. That work. Yeah. It's gonna look a lot better. Right on. Right on. We're doing lots of open shelving this season. I like it. In a rental place, you don't need like a lot of stuff. Yeah. So it's nice to just see as a guest what you have to use, what's available, and it doesn't hurt if it looks cute. Okay, I'm gonna grab the that paint. Okay, I'll take these off. in a high gloss finish and that's because high gloss is going to be easier to clean for those high touch areas and we want to use a high gloss finish so that it has a different look from the other painted surfaces like the walls. How are you doing over there? Because I'm almost done. Yeah, basically done. It probably needs a second coat but I'm good to leave it and let it dry for now. Is that a later us issue? That's a later me problem. You know what's a now me issue? What's that? Taking a break slash just being done for the day. Yeah, I'm for that. And getting in that lake, maybe? I want you to go in, because you've been talking the game this whole time. Yeah, have I? Yes, I'm you just, have. It's been a long day <laughs> in the sun. All right, well, I'm done. I'm packing up. Okay, same. I'm calling it. Same, 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 same. Whew. Okay. I'm not gonna do a big jump because I think it's kind of shallow. Okay, go. You have to go! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> How is it? Oh, we're good! You should come in! You want some gram photos? <laughs> yeah. Yes. <laughs> <Shut> <laughs> <up>. <laughs> that ruined the illusion so hard when you stood up. <laughs> Give me your best aerial. Oh, hold oh. on, I can stand up. I was like, how am I gonna flip my hair? Ready? Wait, should I? Okay, hold on. Let me do the, the rapid burst and then we can get the best frame. Ew, I hate this. <laughs> I'm not this Instagram girl, but okay. Ready? Yep. Oh, this is way better than I thought. Thought it'd be cold. Good. Okay, I have for you. All of my heat stroke just went away. Wait, sunstroke or heat stroke?
got my rain boots on today. <laughs> Wait, actually? Like, no, but... I guess those would be pretty water Out of all the shoes I have with me, these are the best rain boots. <laughs> True, true. But like legit, hopefully it holds off. Cause... White shoes on mud day though, we're both thinking. <laughs> I'm definitely a little stressed about the rest of today. I think we're missing just a lot of vintage things. Yeah. Like it's looking good in the fact that we like fixed up the cupboards and the walls are clean and white now. But like, if we can't fill it with like that vintage 50s stuff, then it's kind of like all for naught. Yeah, it's just gonna look like a, a nice, simple cabin but i want a theme i know like we found some stuff on facebook marketplace last night we can send somebody out to get those do you want to go to any of the thrift stores that might be open i would love to like now that the rest of the cottage is looking good that couch that i was like oh it's simple it's like neutral it looks fine now i'm like wait compared to like the cool <laughs> coffee table and everything it's looking less fine so if you can get like some kind of quilty blanket thing to go on it that could like yeah hide it that's the hard part, man. When you don't want to like replace everything, you gotta make it work. I'm gonna finish this coffee and then maybe I'll start calling around, see what stores I can go to. So this kind of is where the dining nook was, but we're gonna make it more of a nook and less of a table in the middle of the room. We have this little guy which is definitely a vintage table. And I love these chairs that we found. I just love the print and they're super vintage. And they have a little Toronto stamp on the bottom, which is cute. Not that we're in Toronto anymore. What if did it like? Let me just try something. Cute, cute. Coffee table, madame? Oh, uh, yes, please. <laughs> Thank you. It's actually very handy. You're so welcome. So, did you get a hold of any thrift stores I can call? Yeah, I, there's one that I know is open from 12 till 3. And yesterday, when I posted that Instagram, this viewer said that she was from the area. So I was like, do you know any thrift stores? Tell oh, me. Way. So I have a whole DM thread with her that she sent me so many. Hannah send to me. I send to you, I screenshot and send to you. She also said Hidden Treasures, which I think we were thinking about going to, right? Mm-hmm. Great. Love yeah, that. Yeah, Holly was telling us about that. So it'll be great to go see it. Sick. Okay, what do you think about this dining nook? Like maybe it feels too squishy in that corner. We have so much space out here. That's my only thought, but it is cute. The dining nooks get squished in a corner. I know, but- You the... want it to be not a dining nook anymore? How did you have it before? Let's see. I feel like it just makes it a little squishier for the chairs, but. I like the table and bench and, well, all of it. <laughs> that way is my vote, I think, yeah. Okay. It's nice, like, the chairs this way just feel more, like, open to the space. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Then we'll do a cute little pendant. It's looking really cute. And I, like, that curtain now, the original one, looks really great. I know. I love when we can make the original items just work. It's so good. Work. Okay. <laughs> um... I think there's like more things I can do, curtains. Yeah, I'm gonna start calling this list. Okay. Um, do you have, another thing I was looking for is wall hooks like for a coat. Yeah, like a... And then, uh, are you open for in-store shopping? Okay, so just curbside, don't they? To place an order. Okay, thank you so much. You too. Bye. Just go wide? Yeah. If nothing's really going there. I mean, this TV stand will be in front of it. So. Okay, I think I need a hand with this. Yep. Yeah. Are these the curtains that were already here? Yeah. Oh, nice. I love, again, another thing we get to use again. It was on our scheme. I think there's a way to string these so that you don't see the grommets. Go the other way. Yeah. Yeah. You want them to just kind of graze the floor? Yeah. So that looks good. Okay. How far extra is yours sticking off the end? I guess how far do you want it? Oh, far? I think just touching, like the like the edge. Just the tip? Yeah. But then also like at your end, how much tip um, extension do you have? I ha I would say I have eight inch tip extension. I think you're lying. No one has an eight inch tip extension. <laughs> I've had. <I've> <laughs> 
<laughs> How much tip extension do you have, Becky? Oh, like a foot. <laughs> <laughs> now that is a lie. <laughs> um, okay, I'm gonna push it in, I think a little more. Okay. I gotta loosen this though. I think we need to just push the ends in more. They yeah. look funny on their own, but it looks great. Mm -hmm. Pop of color, it's more fun. Um, not doing too much in here, but I'm gonna put some curtains up here. There was kind of this curtain rod already hanging around. And then we have some art above the beds and some new bedding for later. It'll come together, but really did not need to do much in here. These are really pretty. I legitimately think I have a shirt in this fabric. Did I bring it? I don't think I did. I would love to camouflage though. Camouflage away. Am I stressed? No. Just a little. Like, is this dumb? Is this a waste of time? Should I be doing something else? Yes. Oh, help me. I'm so angry. <laughs> but what I'm really excited for is the art that we're putting up is actually um, vintage photos of this property and the cabins from the 50s. So that's gonna be a really special edition. How did these little guys go? Oh, f me. Can you hold this for me? Thanks. Thanks, Evan. It's super helpful. Let's not get it. Are you? <laughs> Wait, does it fit? Wait, wait. <laughs> I'm just gonna have a nap now. <laughs> okay. I can do it. I can do it. Here we go. Slow and steady. Oh my god. Thank you. Thank you. That looks great. Okay, let's get this art. I'm excited. Two color options. The, oh. the white, which we, which, it was like, you know, the safe, reliable. This was my, it's white. This was my thought. And then this, which is my new favorite color. Oh, that's pretty. It's so nice. Is it's, it too colorful? It's like though? a rich teal. Is this dry? Like, it needs another coat, but you touch it. Okay. I can't see from back there, but option one. Mm -hmm. Option two. Option two. Okay, option two. It's so like a moment. And then since we have the other scones, do we want to use it somewhere else? Should I paint it another color? <laughs> or you primed it. That's true. That's a good question. I don't know. Okay, well I'll touch up blue Both. for sure. Yeah. And then we'll figure out number two later. Great. While Becky heads out to the thrift store, I'm gonna to get to work installing our vintage pendant light. All right, this is great. That's really cute, okay. I know we need lampshades and I'm seeing a ton, this is great. Okay, ideally I wanted to hang this over the table, but I don't have a stud over the table. My stud is here, so I think instead of doing over the table, I'm gonna just do like a little corner moment. 
I thought at first I might have to worry about getting the shades to match, but then I realized the sconces are gonna be in different rooms, different colors. I don't think it matters. <laughs> what is this? A dragon fruit on top and something else on the bottom? Mm-hmm. All wood all day, baby. This is maybe a good option too. Ooh, okay. Stuff like this is really great because I think we're nailing the 50s so far, forgetting a little about the beach. So I'm gonna try and find more beach items. Ooh. Oh, oh. I thought this was a seashell. I don't think it is. Is it? Or is it a leaf? Is she not going anywhere? Okay. Oh, this stuff is good too, like some old retro glasses and stuff. Like what year were people drinking Coke out of bottles like these? I don't know if I know, but I love it. Like this one is great. Better be the f***ing ball that's not working. Hi. How's it going? Good, actually this is great. I found so many good things. Oh my god, I'm so glad to hear that. I have less good news. Oh no, what happened? Um, you want the bad news or the bad news? All of it, I guess. Over our table, which we figured might be an issue, obviously. So it's off centered, but it's in this corner, which I think is cute. Okay. Little, little corner moment. Um, but what is potentially the worst news is that the cord's definitely a little wonky, as this is a vintage lamp. So I'm hoping that we can get a new switch and rewire it, and then it will turn on. Um, this was like the feet, and I don't know if I got feeded or defeated. Who feed it? Who feed Let me show who? you some good stuff, make you feel better. Okay. Okay. Um, okay, this this stuff is, I'm not sure, but you can give me your thoughts. Found these two pillows. Oh, I really like the one on top. The one underneath is like, okay, but. I don't know if it's too modern, but also I think I really like it. I think mixed with like some of the other things we have, it'll be, it'll be good. This blanket, I have another quilt too that's more rainbow, but I just, the colors in this are really nice. Mm-hmm. Go for it. Okay. Places. Wow, we're just ripping through these with yeses. Old badminton racket to like put on the wall. Yeah, I think that's really cute. And we found some vintage like birdies for it. Oh my gosh, can we just play? I know. <laughs> yeah, I know. Um, okay, some small stuff that I'm just gonna grab. Don't need to show you all of it, like some little candles. Found yeah. some literal boat like Boot, like, yeah. What do you call these? Yeah, Bodies. they're like the things that stop your boat from crashing into the dock. Exactly. Oh my so God. I'm gonna grab those. Those are perfect. I know. And then, okay, you're gonna love this. Oh my God, there's more. For our TV stand. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. Right? Yes. Oh my God. Perfect. I was so worried we didn't have anything good. Oh my God. <laughs> It's perfect. I wouldn't even do anything to it. Um, okay, wow, sounds like everything is a yes. I'm just gonna grab it all and then come back quick and we can finish this up. Yes, please, hurry back. Love it, will do. Okay, see you in a bit. Okay, see you, bye. Bye. <sighs> okay. I guess I better get this place in shape.
I'm back and I'm bringing you the best find first. Oh, girl. Right? I love that. It's like maybe a little low for the TV, but it's just so cute that I'm not even mad about it. Me neither. I will picture a loon beside it. <laughs> Good thing we have how many to work Bring with? Bring back the loons. Bring back the loons. Um, okay, but there's so much more stuff I got, so do you want to help me grab from the van? Yeah. And I think it just makes sense to just start placing it around, so final touches. So is that final touches? I think so. Okay, I'm really ready for this. Okay. It's been a Bring long day. Bring it home. Bring it home. It's been a long day. <laughs> I commend them on trying to finish that all out because I know I couldn't. I'm very appreciative. I'm just happy that somebody else has done this and I didn't have to do it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited for you to see it. I love how this one turned out. We took your 50s cabin on a beach and just like ran with that. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> so I'm gonna give you back the keys. You guys can go check it out on your own. All right? Okay, yep. hey, I'm so excited. Okay, enjoy. Okay, we're gonna watch. <laughs> You're gonna wanna bring this into our house now. It's so big in here. Yeah. table. I'm just so excited. Dude, look at the cupboards, Abby. Oh, there's so much, but there's real knobs. <laughs> Yay. Wow. I'm so excited. Look at the radio up there. Oh, it's so cute. The vintage radio. Everything is so different. Hey? It's so different. I don't even know what to do. <gasps> oh, Abby, look, look, look at it. it. Look at the spots. They're so cute. Oh, look at you painted the table. Oh, look at this. That's I a love, funky color. I love the bedding. Yeah. Look at the pictures, Al. How cool is this? I, I love, love it. that light. Yeah, it's cute, eh? And it's so nice because there's not like a lamp on that table now. Yeah. Everybody will have room to set their phones and their water. Yeah. That is beautiful. Huh? I love it. Hello. <gasps> Hi. So, we approve? We love we it. We love it. Okay, great. I'm so we glad. We love it. 
I was so glad to hear that. I'm so glad. Because we didn't even really discuss the theme. You just let us go wild, which is our favorite. Yeah. 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 No, sure. you guys we did. It was, it's a tremendous. You guys did a great it. job. Great job. <laughs> Does the record player work? Yeah. Yes. Wow! Yeah. yeah! We were playing That's some so of them cool. today, and it just oh, sounds yeah. so vintage, so oh. it really adds to the space. Oh. Oh. This is beautiful. You girls outdid yourself. Thank you yeah. so much. Thank that you. means you guys a lot. Awesome. Thank you. Um, well, I think that's all from us. Thank you for hosting us. Mm-hmm. You're welcome. Yeah. Enjoy Bye. the space, guys. Bye. Yeah. Thank Bye. you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> Thanks for tuning into this episode of Upgrade My Stay, and we will see you next time.